controlling your menu shouldn't be complicated. When it comes to making changes to your menu, we know how important it is for your customers to see the most accurate and up-to-date information. With Otter's menu management feature, you can make adjustments to your menu across all your delivery platforms and locations. In today's video, we'll walk through how you can upload, edit and publish your menus, mark an item unavailable and edit prices, categories and pictures, all from one place. We'll also answer frequently asked questions related to menu management to help troubleshoot any issues. Ready to make the most of your menu? Let's dive into our demo. To get started, log in to your Otter dashboard and click on the Menus page. Here, you can import your menu from a delivery partner or create a new menu manually. To import an existing menu, click Import from Existing Service. Next, choose which brands you would like to import your menu for. Now, select the location in which your menu should be published. Finally, select the delivery service you would like to import your menu. Once the import is done, you'll be able to see your imported menu in the All Menu section. To create a menu manually, click Create Manually within Otter in the Menu tab. Now, add your menu name. From here, select the brand you want to update and press Continue. Finally, select the locations where you would like to serve that menu. To complete your menu, add categories, items, modifiers, menu hours, and photos. Don't worry, we cover how to edit these sections later in this video in the menu editing timestamp. To edit an item's prices, click on the item you want to edit. Scroll down to the pricing section, edit the price, and then click on Save. This will save your changes across all delivery channels and locations. If you wish to edit an item price for a specific location or for a specific delivery channel, you can do so by clicking on Advanced Pricing. If you wish to edit an item's price for a specific location, then select the location for which you want to edit the item price from the drop down menu above and edit the price in the Default Pricing section. Then click Done. And don't forget to save your changes. To edit an item's price per delivery service, scroll to the Price Override section. Select the Price per Channel option from the drop down menu, and then assign the item price for each active delivery service. Don't forget to save your changes. To edit a category, Click on the category to change the name or description. You can also add items to the category, plus, remove items and delete the category. To edit a specific item, click on the item to change its name, description, image and price per delivery app. Add the item to a category and tag it as alcohol or not. To add modifiers or edit existing ones, click Edit Modifier Group. Here, you can edit names and descriptions. You can also add modifiers, rearrange them and change the price, or make a modifier required or optional. To adjust hours, click on the Hours tab. You can enable unique hours per day and add opening and closing hours. Here, you can also add special hours, for example, national holidays. To edit or add photos, navigate to the Photos tab. 
select the photos you want to choose. Click on Assign to Items and press Save Changes. Within the Photos tab, you can also bulk upload multiple photos. To do so, select the photos you want to include and click Assign to Items. Make sure to save changes. To mark an item as unavailable, simply select it and click on the pencil in the Item Availability section. If applicable, select one or multiple locations where you want to deactivate this item. You can choose to make an item unavailable for today only or indefinitely. You can remark the item as available when it is back in stock. You can also mark modifiers as unavailable by clicking on the Modifiers tab and clicking the Change Availability button. Now that we've covered how to manage item availability, let's learn how to make copies of our menus and manage them all. To make a copy of your menu, follow these easy steps. One. Open your Otter dashboard. 2. Go to Menu in the sidebar. 3. Select the menu you want to copy. 4. Select Make Copy of Menu. Otter's multi menu feature allows you to run multiple menus for a single location. You can set up specific menus for breakfast, lunch, dinner, and more directly within your Otter dashboard. So let's say you want to add a dinner menu. Simply navigate to the overview and select Add Menu. Create your menu by adding categories, items, and modifier groups. After you have added a menu, you will get a pop-up prompt to update the menu hours in the Hours tab. To do so, go into the Hours tab. Here, you can manually set menu hours for your dinner menu. Finally, indicate which days and times your dinner menu will be offered on all delivery channels. Thanks for watching. If you have any additional questions about using menu management, Check the link in the description to visit our Help Centre for more.